Hey guys, it is Duke, and welcome back to another episode of Minecraft Mini Biomes Survival Let's Play. How are you guys doing today? I hope you're doing fantastic. Chickens, I see no eggs. That is disappointing. Um, but I hope you guys are having a tremendous day, because I know I am, and I'm glad to be back for another episode. So, I, uh, I had an issue in the last episode, if you guys do recall, where I was having the biggest issues making big trees, and suddenly I'm realizing we're going to need skeletons, uh, because, well, we do not have any bones so let's see if there's any in here real quick that would be tremendous oh there's not all right well we'll just light this up so we don't have to worry about spawns in here eventually um and oh a little bit of a lag spike that's uh it's a little worrisome but nothing too crazy so let's just head right on over here into the mine um you know i think everybody was okay was pretty much what we had done what we'd found everything everything was good and dandy um, so I, I'm glad to hear that, um, because it is such, you know, a positive thing and a confidence booster when I hear you guys are enjoying what I'm doing, you know, as well. I mean, that's just awesome. So let's just dig a weed these, because we've got a cave on this side, and hopefully I have not lit it all up yet. <laughs> all right, yeah, 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 okay, over here, we're good. Um, what is this? I have not checked this area out. Okay, there's some iron here. Oh, there's lapis. That's good. More iron. I see that. Uh, but really, for the once in my life, I am looking for mobs. So if we could find some of those, that would be great. <laughs> Apparently, we're not going to be as lucky. So you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to wait until we get some skeletons because I don't want to do anything else in today's episode until I show you how to make the big trees. Oh, hi. I see I didn't light this place up very well. Which, for once, is actually a good thing. And you're dead. And that's a single bone. Two bones. Okay, actually, actually, that's, that's a lot better. Uh, we're going to hopefully find more. This is all explored cave, so... I don't know if I didn't light any place up. I assume I lit it all up, but you never know. Oh. Oh, here we go. Here we go. I don't know why I did not explore this, but uh, let's see. We're at 24, so we might actually be able to find diamonds here. And more iron. That is... That is wonderful, absolutely beautiful, and I'm so very happy. All right, so let's dig this up. Thank you. And we don't have another pickaxe on us because we weren't really, ex <laughs> weren't planning on going mining. So hopefully, uh, we can get this stuff and get out of here relatively quick. And if we find diamonds along the way, of course we'll mine those. Um, but I think we'll just sort of avoid other ores. Just because it's not really necessary for us at this moment. Hi. Ah. Don't be a jerk. Oh, you're gonna blow up. That could have been that could have been really bad. Luckily. Oh, oh, oh. Get back there. Get behind him. Shoot! No! Oh, he didn't kill the skeleton. Okay, good. There we go. Now I get to kill him. <laughs> that is a win. Alright, let's continue headed this way, because I don't think. Hi, I heard you. Oh my gosh. Um, I heard that skeleton, but I didn't know where it was. You're going to blow up, sweets. I am fine with that. C come on down. There you go. You just jumped for it. He wanted it all. All right. He did not give us a bone. Luckily, there's another one over there. There are a lot of mobs in this world, guys, and I don't know if I've changed it to hard yet, but that's, that's what I want it to be on. Hi. Hi. All right, all right. You're dead. More bones. That's good. I haven't found anything yet. There's some lapis there, but nothing too crazy. Also, how strange is it that we've turned the dungeon spawner up a little bit and have not found any dungeons? I hear a skeleton. I think. Yes, I do. I do hear one. I don't know where he is, though. Let me grab this gold, because actually, I think I want it. So, <laughs> let's just pick that up real real nice and quick. And block that off so it doesn't come this way. And is there another water source coming? Yes, there is. We will block that off as well. Perfect. Let's grab this. 
You know, if my pickaxe breaks, I guess I'll use the diamond one for a little bit. Eh, I don't really want to, but it might not be too big of a deal. Alright, well, let's pillar up, try to find this guy. Actually, that's that's all. <laughs> that's probably my worst idea so far in this series. Because if he hits us, we're probably going to fall to our death. And you guys can't see anything. Um, What have I... What is this? What am I looking at? Oh, okay. Can't get in there. Alright, let's just head back. We have enough. We should be able to get one or two trees. Right? Yeah, I think we're good. Okay, let's just head back. I'll be back with you guys in just a moment. Ah, we're back up here, and let's test it out. Did that one grow? Alright, I don't remember if that was growth on last episode or not, but that one did grow. So, here is the plan. We take our pickaxe. Oh, 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 melons. Oh, we're going to get some food to eat. That is good, because these uh, rotten flesh aren't doing us a whole lot. So, let's place those around there. We get rid of the thing in the middle. Um, and this was brought to my attention by a user by the name of Thundersfun. Uh, he commented on the last episode, told me, hey, Magmusin, um, is another YouTuber to go check out his tutorial on how to make big trees. And I did. So thank you so much, Thundersfun, for this. But you guys are probably, like, confused because if you've been watching my channel for a while, oh, it works so easy. That is good. Um... If you guys have been watching my channel for a while, I've done this before. I've used this trick before, so don't... <laughs> um, I don't have any clue why I did not think about this. Because if you guys... Oh, that one grew too. Great. Um, if you guys do not recall, uh, when I was on Afterlife and I was building the park along with Dragon Frost and Night Fox, we used this technique. And it worked very, very well. Sometimes. <laughs> It works tremendous half the time. All right, so let's just take that out and let it decay. Uh, but really, this is a tremendous, tremendous way of growing big trees. So thank you, Thundersfun, for bringing this to my attention again. Uh, I thank you so very much for that. And let's just well, let's just use these. I don't I don't really care. All right, um, get rid of you, bye boy, and take that out in the middle. And we'll try here. Um, good enough. <laughs> That's a glorious tree over there, but I guess this one isn't as good. But we'll, we'll find. Let's just chop down these little guys because they're not what we're looking for. This one tried to be big tree, but it was never a big tree. Kind of reminds me of myself. <laughs> there was an effort made. It just came up short. Okay. <laughs> That's enough. That's enough of um, sad talk. Let's be happy. All right. Take away you, take away you, it's so dark. Let's grab some torches and put them on the ground so you guys can see what I'm doing because Minecraft is dark on YouTube. Actually, all videos are dark on YouTube. Yeah, I guess we'll keep this tree for now. If we can get a better one, we will, um, but I don't hate it. Oh, well, there goes all of those. Uh, that's unfortunate. I guess we'll have to get more, but we got one for sure tree so we can sort of you know, mirror our other trees off of that if we do end up with a whole lot of bones. Um, but guys, I will be right back with you so we can dive into today's episode. Alright guys, so in today's episode we are going to be building a mini, obviously, uh, little fishing shack. So, nothing too crazy here, but I'm, you know, I'm excited to get working on it. I don't really know, um too much about these things because I've never actually built one uh, that I can think of before so obviously we're going to go pretty darn tiny with this thing and uh, I guess that's to be expected um, but I'm going off nothing okay so I'm really just going to be building this with you guys on camera I don't know what to expect I kind of know um, what I'm what I'm picturing Oh, new recipes. Yes, I know. Thank you. Uh, <laughs> I kind of picture something, but if I don't accomplish that, then I don't accomplish that. Uh, and, I, and I may not accomplish that. So, there we go. We're going to build these pillars up, and we use spruce at the base. That is not a trick that I've come up with. Um, 
that is an old trick, and it looks like, you know, the bottom log is wet, which is, is really good for a build that's standing in water. Makes sense. Uh, so what I want to do next is I want the floor to be raised up one before we really start focusing on this. So let's take, let's take these oak woods and let's turn them into, give me oak just a little bit. That's 18 is fine by me, so we'll take this up one. And we'll build it around in here like so. Alright, so we want this raised up and out of the water. I think we accomplished that right there. Nothing nothing too crazy, um, but we're getting somewhere. Okay, so then what I want to do is I want to have... I want to use, use birch. So I don't know if this is going to look okay or not. Um, but let's build up our corners with oak. And then we'll have spruce next to these like this we might be able to get something out of this if not we can always take it down and and try again I just want to see if this style will work um, okay um, then we're gonna take these birch and we'll turn a decent a bit of them into stairs I don't know if we want all of them to be stairs but we want some of them to be stairs so then we're gonna go around and we're gonna place them in like so all right, nothing, nothing too crazy right here, but should look nice nevertheless. Uh, we want that one at the bottom, that one at the top. Actually, I don't know if I should have done that on that side because I almost want to leave that side undone for now, but we definitely can on this side because we are going to have a dock, and I don't know where I want that dock to go for now. Uh, but then in these, I want to have oak fence as my windows. I think that'll look, that'll look okay think that'll look all right yeah that's that's fine by me okay so then let's hop up here I think what I wanted um I was gonna have these laid down I don't know if this is gonna work how I planned it because it might be a little too tall so we may have to make some adjustments um, but let's bring these out on all the corners not right there I'll pick you up in a second. All right, this may be a little too tall. We might have to break down a block and go from there. Um, but then what I want to do is take... Oh, we're not going to be able to reach that. There we go. We'll take these and we will make spruce stairs. All right. And then let's pill her up. And we're losing night... Or we're losing daytime, so we're going to have to sleep here in a second. Uh, so we'll put those down like so in the creases so we're using three different types of wood here um, but I think we should be able to pull this off because I, I I've I know these woods do work well together I just don't know if I can personally do it uh, so we'll go like that and we will sleep because it is nighttime and I don't want to get attacked so I'm a little bit worried about that let's jump into bed uh, so I may have to turn down a few of my settings right now because we are starting to lag a little bit. Let's move this down to 12. And I don't know why we're lagging because, oh, geez, that was a huge frame boost. Okay, we'll just play with this then. This is fine. Um, I don't know why we're lagging because when I first started this world, um, we didn't have any. And... I do know that you know the more you explore and the more you build, uh, the world's gonna take up a few more, a few more gigs. So obviously, I'm gonna have to worry about lag a little bit more. Uh, but I, I don't know. I feel like it shouldn't because in other worlds I've played in, just just for the heck of it, because I wanted to test it out um, before I dove right into something. So what if we did? What if we did something like this? I don't know, but we're not lagging anymore, so that is a good thing. Let's tear these out. Okay, I guess you're in a fine spot. Actually, you're not going to be in a fine spot. I want you... I want you to be... We might go with a slab there. What I'm thinking is something... Something a little different, okay? Just so it's not a, a cone-shaped roof. So what if we did that? Well, it's still going to be a cone-shaped roof no matter what. It, it's just... I want it to look good, so oh, we do. I do guess we do have some of those. So what if we made another four of those? That'll be fine, and we make some more of these as well. 
Let's grab those. We'll bring them down. We'll place that like this. Let's jump up. Uh, we go slabs in the corners. Like that. Okay. And then we could do this. Which I think we will do. I think we're going to need some more spruce. Oh, no. We have some spruce on us. We're good. Uh, let's put these in the corners like so. Not upside down. That is not what I wanted to do, and we lost that one. So let's just jump down, and we'll work from the inside so we don't have to keep doing this. Uh, so to work from the inside, I guess we can jump in, but it's, it's you know, that's not, it's not perfect. So let's grab another slab like so. And would it look okay brought out like that? I don't know. I do kind of like how it's hidden back there. So maybe we'll only do this on the front side. Uh, and we could use a spruce stair in the front. Not opposed. But which door do we want? We'll try We'll try just oak doors because we have a whole lot of oak to work with. So we'll put that in there. That's fine, I guess. I don't know. Okay, let's. we'll come on in here. And I did not pick up the crafting table. So let's do that real quick place it down in here for easy easy grabs and we'll jump up let's grab a few more just a little bit more and I'm just gonna handcraft these cuz uh, the recipe book takes a while if if you're not used to it like I'm not uh, so we'll put that there and then what if we cover that like this and I want to place it outward and I don't know what I'm gonna do here we might That's not horrible, but I don't know if that's going to work either. We might have to take a step back and look at that. So let's let's do it on all of the corners just so we can we can see if that looks good or not. Cause I, I, I want to know if it looks good. So let's put that there, put that there. We need more spruce. <laughs> Always out of resources. I mean, we have them. It's just we have to turn them all over, and we can't because we need to make more of these. All right, we'll just tear all those out, and boom, there's some more right there. Jump up, place, 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 place. Tear these out on the undersides. I don't know if this is going to look good. It might. It might look okay, but it might be a little bit too much as well. For the, for the size of the build, this might be a little too much. <laughs> we might be trying more than we should. Okay, so... No, I don't like that. I don't like that at all. Not a fan. I do want to try this, though. Does that help? Just the overall build? I think, it, I think it will. It gives a little bit more detail to it. Yeah, I do like those. Okay, so let's just fix the roof. And we may be on to something. You know, I probably should have done this in a single-player world first. I guess this is single player, but like a creative world, you know? Uh, just so we can really test it out. Because we're going to be testing out lots of different things. So, let's grab... Um, actually, we don't need to grab anything. We can just pull her right up and break this out. And we'll tear these out as well. And this might look tremendously better. It could. Actually, that might actually look kind of cool. Just like, hold up a second. Does that look good? I don't know if I like that as much as I like this side. I don't know. I don't think that's horrible. I don't think that's horrible. Let's, uh, let's try it out again. Alright, uh, I guess we'll... We'll keep working with it until we get something we really like, I guess. I mean, that's that's what you do, right? You know, there's a lot of a lot of mistakes, a lot of changes, but eventually I'll get something here that'll look good. All right. We'll test this out and while we're doing that, let's grab ourselves. Oh, we have plenty. I didn't even see that. Uh, let's turn those over into sticks and sticks in the middle and those along there. Let's take everything back. We don't want to make too many because I don't think we're going to need too many. Uh, and boom, boom. How does this look? Uh, 
I don't know. It's kind of derpy. It's so tiny. Um, so we don't have a whole lot done with it yet, but I think we'll leave the roof as is for now. Um, I just think if we add a little bit of something onto the side, I was going to have the dock straight out the back. But I don't think I want to do that anymore. So what if we come on in here and we take the dock out this side? Alright, so we'll take all this out. And give me those. And we step it down one. After we put another door. It's kind of going to be odd on the inside, but I don't think it'll be too bad from the outside. So we don't want it like that, but if we do a little bit of extra placing, we can get to where we want to be. So, then I think I want this to be at that height. So it's floating over the water, but not on the top block. That might actually help us out a little bit. So if we put that there and make some more. But all these, no, no, <laughs> give me. Thank you. I don't know if we want two wide or three wide. Also, I don't know if we want it connected or not. I don't know, two wide might be good. Normally, I would not go too wide. The only issue is I don't want to make this too big. So let's just test this out. We'll bring it out a little bit more. Say so that's, that's an okay length. And we'll bring spruce at the bottom up to that point and up to that point an oak on top of that and maybe a little huh do we want to just connect that with oak fence no that looks like something I'd be building in like Minecraft beta when we don't have too many options so you just sort of make something up as you go That's, I feel like that's really overkill. <laughs> um, I don't think it looks horrible, but a little overkill. So what if... Can I jump onto that? I can. I should know that. I should definitely know that. For the amount of time I've put into this game, I should know stuff like that. Uh, nope, that is not the right block I want that on. Give me that back. Uh, so what if we put this down... I don't think that's going to work. Because it's basically what we tried. We just put stairs under it. Hmm. I do like the fact that it does prevent you from going over. That's actually not too bad of just just the, the, the feel behind the fact you can't just walk right over that. Um, so it gives you a little bit of something. But I don't know. If I like that. So maybe, what if we top this off with some different blocks? I don't know which one we exactly want to go with, but we could try that. And we could go right here, I think, is where we want our next pillar to be. We'll bring that up. More stairs under. I don't know. It defeats the purpose of having the floating-looking bridge. Or the floating-looking dock. But I don't know if that's a horrible thing to do. And this might be a little difficult to do some placing here. Uh, but we'll go like that. Go like that. And I guess we'll do it again here. I was going to say we'll put another pillar here. But I don't think that'll look... I don't actually know if what I want to do in that corner yet. Let's go sleep because it is late. Put some torches on this build so it, you know, there's a little bit of light here. Let's just hop into bed though. <laughs> and you know what? I'm going to mess around with it a bit more um, because this has been a long clip and I'll be back with you guys. Oh, we are on to something. I've had a few bits of creativity spike and uh, I, think, I think we're really going to make this place look substantially better. I mean, it was, it looked okay. And I gotta say, I, I would have liked it, I think, if we kept what we had. But, uh, <laughs> I'm not gonna show you too much right now. 
because we're just going to build it. And then I'll not fill this place with water. Um, we got chimney. I don't know if that's what I want for a chimney, but I don't hate it. Those are those are actually okay. Those are actually okay. I'm not hating that. All right. Okay. We are got like I said, guys. We're making moves here, and I think everything we're doing with this place is helping. All right. So let's take away those. Let's take. Let's flip that over. Give me. Good. This. I mean. I. Okay. I did it on the front. I took a step back, and I'm like. Wow. <laughs> Literally, it looks so much better. Um, did I put my crafting table down? I did not. Let's make a few more of these. Actually, that, that might be perfect for the amount that we're going for. All right, and then you go upside down. You go right side up. Slab. So we have a bigger roof, which helps all so very much. Uh, right that, right there. Is that what we wanted? That might be what we wanted. Let's take a step down here real quick. And if everything's gone to plan... Oh, hi. <laughs> if everything's gone to plan, we should just have the interior to work on. We should. If everything's gone to plan. Let's take a step back and let's look at this. Oh, that looks better. Oh, that looks... Oh, that looks so good. Oh! Look at that. Look at that. Let's get our screenshot over here. So, I thought about it, guys. We had stone bricks on the top. And, uh... Of the top of the pillars. And it looked good. It added a little bit of color that we didn't have. You know, everything was wood. It was all that tan sort of... Of look but I think I think we made some good moves right there guys let's get I, I, I'm looking for the greatest screenshot I can get of this and I think that might be about right here so let's oh actually I kind of like this let's uh so let me see again oh I see you you don't want to be there I don't want you to be there uh, and we'll jump over here, and we'll jump like this. Why does that look a little bit funny? I can't see that. Did we not do it on this side? Or can you just literally not see it from there? I literally cannot see it from there. Okay. It's just, it's just the angle we're taking it at, apparently. You cannot see that side, but this is... I almost do want to see that. Because I know it'll look good, so... Boop boop. You can you can you can see the you can see it kind of, but it it is right there. All right, so that is fine for a screenshot. Beautiful. Okay, so let's finally talk about what we actually did after I pick up these oak wood planks. So we went ahead, turned over that stair in the middle there, and when I did that, it definitely helped. But then I was like, I need to pull this one out. So I pulled it out and added it on either side so it didn't look out of place. And I put that block on top, um, which I originally wanted in the design, but it did not fit where it was. So once I brought it out, I tried it, and it looked so much better. Uh, we added buttons, which, like I was talking about the stone bricks, but I definitely, definitely got sidetracked. Uh, adding in a little bit of gray did help substantially, uh, and I think that looks really good. Also, our chimney up top. As you can see, that is a full block right there, um, but that one right there is a half slab on top, and it definitely helps the appeal of the build. I definitely have to say, we did something I like, and I was a little bit worried at first I wasn't going to like this in the end. I feel like I had this mindset that when we were done with it, I was going to sit there and be like, wow. I've let myself down with what I've built, but that certainly did not happen at the end, and I'm glad it didn't because I think I think we have a real winner here, so I kind of want to add a little bit of stuff on the inside. So what if we do that there, we put our chest right here, we need some lighting in here, so why not uh, 
torches on the stairs. That's fine. We need clay. We definitely need some clay. Let's let's look for some clay because actually clay will be very valuable for us um, here soon enough. Oh, 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 there's clay right here. Um, look at this. This is not my design either. Um, like I like I mean actually this is in the end it is uh, but this right here is not this uh, I don't know who came up with that but I've seen it on different servers I've been a part of and stuff and it's just a little fish trap um, made purely oh ooh, ooh, yeah 20 I think we'll I think we'll stick with that actually let's get 24 so we can get a nice number divisible by three uh, yeah I th I th I think the fist trap actually looks really cool because, you know, the trap door texture actually does sort of look like a little cage. So that is really, really cool. Let's throw these in here. I think for the inside, we're going to want just a little flower. Nothing too crazy or over the top. Um, but if... What? 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 That was... Okay, that that was a that was a little glitchy apparently. Um, but if you guys don't know what we're doing, we are getting ourselves a little clay pot like that one. Um, there it is. Now we have it, and let's find it. There it is, flower pot. We'll put our little dandelion in it on our little table that we made, and I think that'll that's that's really appealing. Actually, it is. So there we go. And I know there's some yellow with the birch, but we don't have any really other color. Oh, I didn't realize you could do that. I thought you had to break it. Huh. Learn something new every day. And we got this nice little space over here I think is is fine. I, I would... Oh, no, 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 no. I thought of just what we should add. Yes. Do we have... Yes, we do. Oh heck yeah! This is this will look good. Just a nice little bookshelf. It adds a little bit more color, and it gives a reason for the corner. You know, it, it that looks nice. That looks nice. I like it. And we could even tap it off with a little a little spruce wood slab. Awesome! This is cozy. I like this build a lot. I was really worried I would not. Uh, and one thing that we cannot quite do yet is leash up a... Well, you can't leash up a boat. Am I stupid? Yes, you can. No, you can't. Can you? <laughs> I don't know, but let's make ourselves a birch boat, and it'll just chill right there. And we have, our, we have actually, a very beautiful little bay area here, so that is, that is really, really cool. Man, I forgot how weird boats were. We oh man, we're doing spinnies. Um, but I will be right back with you guys for the comment of the day. Ah! Alright guys, it is time for comment of the day. So comment of the day for episode 3 is by the name of Telex Gaming. So Telex Gaming said, what exactly does mini apply to? This is a great question. Uh, does absolutely everything have to be mini, or can you have regular size farms, storage rooms, strip mines, etc.? Great video, by the way. So, like I said, great question, and I did respond to him and try to answer it uh, in text a little bit. Um, but I'm here to tell you guys now, um, for those who probably don't check comments after you know you after you're done commenting, you probably don't check to see what other people say. Um, but this was a great one, and. I think I should let everybody else know. So, uh, what I said in the comment had to do with, uh, well, I'll build mini for things that I can make mini. Anything that I can possibly miniaturize, I will. Um, things like, you know, farms, whether it's like a mob farm, I cannot necessarily make that smaller. So, it's going to be as small as that can be. Um, but obviously, you know, there's a limit. So, I can't make it any, any smaller. Uh, and then things like storage rooms might be difficult to make smaller, but I've slightly changed my answer to what I've done. So, in today's episode, we did make a mini fishing shack, which, as you can see, is right here. It's about as small as I can go, uh, and I do like that a lot. Um, our mine shaft, the exterior, I tried to make as small as possible, um, but 
you know, a mine shaft, you know, it's, it's going to be big down below. So the tunnel itself, I'll try to make small, um, but you know, I'm going to have to dig. So there's no way I can make it smaller than what it is. Uh, this bridge, for example, okay, I tried to go and make it as tiny as possible. And obviously there's a little bit that needs to be changed about that to make it smaller, um, while still looking good. But, you know, we still have to go from this side to that side of the land. You know, each bank has to be connected somehow. So, it, you know, has to be a certain length no matter what. And, you know, stuff like farms like this, um, I plan on making micro melon and, and, and other farms, you know, as, as, as small as possible. But there's going to be certain things, again, like a mob farm or perhaps a storage room, that I'm going to be sort of limited on in terms of, of how small I can really make it. So we'll sort of take it by air. We'll see how, how you know, how it goes, <laughs> really. I mean, really, that's the best answer I can come up with. We'll see how it goes for a lot of things. Um, but if I can make it small, I'll make it small. If not, we'll do our best. So I uh, hope you guys have enjoyed. If you did, please be sure to leave a like, comment down below, tell me what I'd like to see next. And if you're new to the channel or the series, be sure to subscribe. This has been Duke. I'll see you in the next episode. Have a good day. Bye-bye.